Our lead story this half hour, FedEx and Amazon are responding to employees who claim the shipping companies were not doing enough to keep their factory workers safe during this pandemic. WCPO 9 News reporter Courtney Francisco has been following this since the first complaints came into our newsroom. Now workers are seeing some changes. I have a list from Amazon and FedEx here in Northern Kentucky after workers shared their concerns. I ultimately made the decision right there. My life just isn't worth it. A mother's plea for change caught the attention of FedEx. They don't clean our workstations. Um, we all use scanners to scan in packages and those aren't cleaned at all. I introduced you to Amanda Redmond March 27th. She stopped working at FedEx because she says she has a seizure disorder and she didn't want to risk COVID-19 complications. It is a horrible decision to have to make. Others described unclean, sweaty wristbands that employees share and people packed in entryways because of increased hiring. After I told FedEx, spokesperson Meredith Miller says FedEx consulted with a leading health and safety expert to put specific measures in place, including individualized wristbands that are not shared between employees, scanner disinfecting measures, enhanced social distancing practices, ensuring a supply of gloves and hand sanitizer, increased ventilation and installation of touchless doors. At Kentucky's Amazon location, an employee says they want hazard pay after managers sent out this voicemail over the weekend. I wanted to let you know that we have a confirmed case of COVID-19 at CVG9. The employee says now Amazon requires temperature checks and provides masks, but says it took too long for changes. He remains anonymous in fear of being fired. We should be getting hazard pay. We're risking our lives coming out here. Our health, our safety. Amazon did not confirm the COVID-19 case in their response, but said we've implemented an additional $2 per hour, double time for overtime, and paid time off benefits for regular, part-time, and seasonal employees. Employees diagnosed with COVID-19 or placed into quarantine receive up to two weeks of pay. We don't get hazard pay. Um, they don't give us, like, sick leave. FedEx Ground says sick pay has been recently enhanced and will get more information soon. There are more details in the emails Amazon and FedEx sent to me. I'll put them all on our website, WCPO.com. Just click on this story. Reporting in Independence, Kentucky, Courtney Francisco, WCPO 9 News.